Ew. Oh. That is one sure way not to get famous, I guess. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's Delicracy here and welcome to a brand new series. I am so excited because this is Let's Play Get Famous Part 1. I've been waiting for this game pack to come out for what feels like an eternity and I'm so excited to share with you my characters that I've been spending all day creating and also their little house I've built and to really get started exploring this expansion pack, becoming a celebrity in The Sims 4 and exploring the acting career and media production. It looks like a really amazing expansion pack. Let's get into it. I also just have to say uh, thank you to EA for making this video possible and giving me early access to get famous prior to release so I could share it with you guys. Oh my gosh, I just looked at the time and it's 20 to one in the morning. <laughs> I got a little carried away today, like playing around with build mode and dressing with Sims and making this storyline. Let's just jump into it. I can't wait to introduce you to my Sims. All right, welcome to my brand new couple of Sims. I did actually talk to you guys about possibly using some characters from our past Let's Play, particularly Hampton Falls. But in the end, I decided it was best to start fresh just because I didn't want there to be any expectations for this Let's Play to be similar to a past Let's Play. I just wanted it to be a whole new Let's Play play that we can all get involved in and enjoy without any other expectations. You know what I mean? So this is Imogen Ray, and she is the girlfriend of Lux down here, who we will be taking a look at in just a second. So Image is going to be our actress. She's moved to Del Sol Valley, I think it's called. And she aspires to be a world famous celebrity. And let me tell you now, she's willing to do anything to get there. And I mean anything. She's desperate. So she is an outgoing sim, uh, which means that she should be very good at schmoozing uh, other celebrities and uh, working her way to the top and getting acting roles. Um, she's also very self-absorbed, so she will always put herself first to get what she wants. I think her character, while she looks quite casual and not overly made up or anything right now, quite normal looking. I think her character and her appearance is going to really change drastically over time. I really want her to go from regular looking girl to sim Hollywood looking girl. So we're gonna get her to work out. She's gonna eventually wear a bit more makeup, change her hair. We're gonna go for that real like stereotypical look that a lot of people are sucked into when they enter Hollywood. So that's what we're going to explore. And she's a romantic Sim, so she may have a little bit of a wandering eye, despite being taken by her boyfriend, who conveniently is very good at editing videos. So she might have found Lux to be the perfect Sim to help her get to where she wants. So yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if she was interested in some other Sims with higher status careers. We'll, we'll see how she goes. So then we have Lux, her boyfriend, and I love Lux. He's so cute. He's probably going to go through a transformation himself, um, but he's going to be focusing on the media career or the media skills. So he's going to be doing a lot of video editing. And unlike his girlfriend, his aspiration is to have successful lineage. He just wants to have a family. He doesn't really care about the fame game. He doesn't care about money. He just wants to, you know, live a happy life. And despite being ambitious, he loves what he does, but he doesn't have to have status and money to feel fulfilled. He's also a loner, so he's not going to want to be going to all of the celebrity um, hot spots or anything like that. He really does keep to himself and just likes to work on his own thing. And he's a geek, like he looks kind of nerdy. Um, he's got a new hairdo, but I think he's going to go, like I said, through a little transformation. We're gonna get these two to work out a bit. I'm just excited for, th for them to have kind of little glow ups. Now I will show you guys some of their outfits. So Lux Nero, by the way, I love the name. It sounds like a record producer or something like Lux Nero. I just kind of put two different names together. I was like, yes, I love it. <laughs> so this is uh, some new pants from the pack, new shirt, but yeah, he's very like basic looking, you know, he's, he's got a bit of a nerdy vibe, but at the same time is a little bit trendy. The guy has a lot of potential. I can tell you that now. I've already had a look at him, how he'll look when I glow him up over time. So I'm excited for that. Uh, he's got some nice athletic wear. Imogen Ray, so this is her everyday outfit for now. 
As I said, she's very casual at the moment. I love this new skirt as well. I think that's very pretty. She's gonna look so different and she's kind of already beginning her transformation now. Like she's already dressing up a little bit since they moved to Del Sol Valley. She's gonna start wearing a little bit more makeup. This is just her casual look for now. Her formal wear is pretty stunning. I love this new dress. And she's got some really beautiful fiery red makeup, which looks pretty amazing with her skin tone. And she's got some workout gear as well, because like I said, they're gonna be working out a bit. Those are just a few different looks, but let's maybe do the little house tour. So I'll invite you inside into the house. We'll see what you guys think. But do comment down below what you think of these two Sims, Imogen and Lux, and I'm excited to get to know them more. I think Imogen's going to get more of a bad reputation and Lux is going to get more of a good reputation. So it's gonna get a little bit saucy. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to play. I haven't done like any gameplay yet, so I'm so pumped to share this with you guys. Anyway, we are in Del Sol Valley in uh, the, the street where the cheaper houses are. I've forgotten what it's called. But anyway, this is a little starter home that I've built. Um, it is going to be on the gallery soon for you guys to download. I will have a speed build of it as well. Um, but this is using as much of the new items as I could on a budget. A lot of things in this game pack are obviously more expensive and lush for when you are famous. So uh, the starter home, we didn't get to use heaps of things, but there were a few kind of 70s items. So I decided let's just make a really kind of old crummy house for them to start off in and over time they're going to make their house look a little bit better and probably move around a little bit so let's go inside knock 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 is anyone home yay so if we go inside uh this is lux's you know media setup over here to the left it kind of fits in perfectly perfectly with those diagonal walls got a little lounge room there with a little TV uh, and then we've got like a kitchen hidey hole here I love kitchen hidey holes I just think they're so inviting and cute so they're sitting on the couch we have a little dining table here for the two of them but yeah it's very very basic it's very like cheap you know cheap living they don't have a ton of money yet I feel like Imogen's going to become very materialistic very quickly this is a new light uh, coffee table and plant love that plant how cute is it? And there's also all new windows, doors. So these guys are just sitting down. Excuse me, Imogen, you need to put your legs together, girl. Over here is their bathroom with a lot of brown tiles. Not particularly appealing, but uh, it, it does the job. If we go across to the other side of our little house abode, uh, this is their bedroom with the new closet rack. So yeah, they're living on a budget. In fact, their budget is so tight. I think they only have yeah, they only have 100 simoleons, so it's a tight budget. I also added a little bit of extra money after um, saving this lot that I built just to do some landscaping for the purpose of making it look a little bit more realistic. There are a lot of trees for this starter home and there's a little bit of terrain here because hello, we just got that terrain manipulation tool and I'm obviously gonna use that. All right, so I guess what we'll do is start off with getting a job. We want to get Imogen to join the acting career, so let's get her to do that. Uh, I think we'll just have a little romantic moment with these two, and uh, we'll just whisper a few sweet nothings and uh, maybe give Lux a little bit of a kiss. I feel like Lux would usually be the more affectionate one unless Imogen wants something. She's a little bit like that and she's definitely charmed Lux a lot and probably knows how skilled he is with video editing and maybe he's helped her with a few of her audition tapes um, to get an acting agent for her acting career. And in terms of skills, she's already got level two acting. Um, she did practice a little bit and Lux over here has level three media production level five photography and six programming and six handiness too. Cause I thought it would just be easier for him to be able to fix a few things around the house. Anyway, image is gonna, um, oh my gosh, she is going to get a job. So let's not register with the ministry of labor. Let's find a job. She's like, oh my gosh, Lux. I can't believe I've sent in my interview tapes. I really, really hope that I get an agent and they want me. So he's probably helped her a lot with that. All right, so here we go, actress. Woohoo! Actors will need to join a talent agency. The spotlight calls the cameras are focused and you are ready for your close-up hopefully not too close it is up to you to breathe energy into the words of the script and really make the characters come alive yay 
Okay. Now hiring an uncredited extra. Let's do it. Okay. So we need to select an agency. Um, we have two kind of dodgy agencies. And as you climb higher in the ladder, you're going to unlock more agencies that have better perks. But for now we can choose AI staffing agency. Um, <laughs> consider AI staffing applicant name. Oh my gosh, that's like the emails I get all the time for sponsorships. <laughs> Our agents look forward to booking your unproductive time with work. Please enable notifications to stay informed on the latest job field opportunities. <laughs> Benefits, improved automated reminders, maximize your time spent working. Oh, okay. All this everyday extras talent agency. Okay. Our team has put faces into every wide angle crowd shot this town has ever filmed. We will find you work no matter how small the role. Okay. Benefits, more auditions for commercial and daytime TV gigs. Ooh, I reckon that one's probably so best. So cool. let's do that. Woohoo! Welcome to the crew, Imogen. We specialize in getting talented service staff members into acting roles, big yeah. and large. Some of our talent even land hung. gigs with actual Who's lines that? to speak. I oh my gosh. Bread. This is going to be a long way to get the, to the top. Don't Hello. let the pressure get to you, though. One we can also two. arrange a few shifts at so Cheslama when the need that? arises. Okay, well, that. That's good. All right, so we have to check out open auditions to see if there's anything um, available. And as a middle range, we'll probably get 640 simoleons at this stage for our gig. Oh, we've got quite a few options right now. <laughs> Making music. Okay. Uh, we'd need to level up our guitar skill. We don't actually have a guitar yet and we have no money, so we probably shouldn't do that. A Salty Suds commercial. Okay. That, uh, that is better pay too. So I kind of like that fitness level two. We do want to get fitter. Um, so this is a gig payout that isn't quite as big. Hmm. Um, or preclinical pharmaceuticals, 450. I mean, should we go for the money? I'm thinking we should go for the money. Although, you know what? Let's go the commercial. Let's go hey, for the nice. most money. She's like, oh my gosh, oh, I got my first commercial <laughs> lux. I'm so excited. Okay, so we need to um, get our charisma level up to two. And it starts at 7 p.m. Tuesday. Oh, okay. Well, we've got plenty of time. I don't know what we're doing going to do in the meantime, but let's maybe uh, practice a speech to get our charisma up. And Lux over here, Lux doesn't have a job. We could find a job for him or we could get him to register with the Ministry of Labor and just be a video editor um, because that's really what he's going to start doing to help pay the rent in this house. And he's probably moved here um, with Imogen to help her pursue her acting career. So let's do a freelance media or freelance video editor. Should we capitalize that? I feel like we should have proper grammar in this let's play. There we go. Um, should we just like say it as if we're advertising ourselves? So Lux is like, hey, uh, <laughs> I specialize, specialize in deluxe. <laughs> Get it? Filming and production. Give me a tinkle. Is it tingle? Tingle. Tinkle on my cell. Okay, there we go. Cool. Oh, look at him. He looks so proud of himself. He's like, yay, I'm getting into the world. I've put my ad out. This is awesome. Oh, so cute. He's also a little bit hungry. Maybe we should get him something to eat. Oh, he's going to get something to eat himself. All right. So over here, I did actually get him to film his first ever vlog here. My first vlog. Embarrassing. Um, and he's edited it a little bit. So the quality is fair. And I was thinking he might upload it to his SimTube channel just because he's like, well, I may as well. Like I haven't really got anything better to do. So we're going to do that and see what happens. So once he's had something to eat, oh, we could add some effects and transitions. You know what? Let's make this video awesome. Okay. Let's like really go all out with it. And um, that can be like his little project for the meantime. We should also check out the town too because they've just moved. Oh my gosh, I thought she was in the shower talking through the mirror, but no. She's like, oh my gosh, I love soapy suds. They make my skin feel so fresh, so refined and so luxurious. I feel like she's going to be really good at being an actress. She's probably not the best actress. She's probably fairly talented at acting, but she's more charismatic than anything. It's who you know, 
not necessarily watching her. No. And she knows that. We've no. added effects successfully to our video. Lens flare, Oops. sparkles, and explosions are all part of the visual experience. Oh my Love gosh, Lux. That is intense editing. I want you to edit my video. Um, oh, we can adjust the lights. Ooh, what's hazy nightlife? This is cool. Hazy night lights, we can buy add on components when we can, um, oh, we can hype our video. Oh, and reply to comments. Cool, we don't even have a video up and we can respond to comments. That's so funny. Maybe potentially Imogen will get quite jealous of Lux if his videos start doing well. And maybe she'd even go as far as to sabotage his videos, which is crazy to do to someone you love. So oh, that's gonna be tea, you guys. Actually, I forgot my tea today. Damn it. We should we should drink tea next episode. Make sure to bring your tea. This really does look like what I used to edit. This is crazy. This is like Adobe Premiere. That is three-way color corrector. That is curves. What? Half of you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, but some of you guys will. And I don't know what that is. This is like the little computer you play Fortnite on because all the pros play on like little little dicky computers. Maybe after a quick bite to eat, we can go check out the town. Not every transition translate into good transitions. The video is now worse than before. What? That's not fair, Lux. Oh no, we worked on it for so long. That's not fair. What quality is it? Oh, fair. Oh, fine. Well, let's upload it and see what what everyone thinks of our video and hopefully they'll like it. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. This is how I feel when I upload videos myself sometimes. He's like, oh, I'll just give this uh, Sims tube thing a go. We'll, we'll see what happens. Mmm, fish tacos. Oh, on the road to fame, Sims now have the ability to become celebrities. There are many different ways to become a celebrity. And as your Sims progress in their skills and careers, more paths uh -huh. to stardom will become available. Some yes. great ways to become famous include pursuing a career in acting or raising the media production skill via the video station or music station objects. Look for interactions labeled with the fame tag. Each of these will contribute towards becoming a superstar. Oh, and we're going to get daily royalty payments from our video that is so cool okay so I guess um he should tell Imogen and he's got a little a little fame mark there where's our fame <gasps> look we have a neutral reputation and he can ask her about her day as well he can be like so how did you go practicing for your sud commercial she's like oh, it was fine she wouldn't really think to ask how his day is at all, I don't think. She'd be the type of person who just answers your questions and then you have to just Boom tell browser. her about yourself. <laughs> or, um, yes. I decided to upload a video today, Tuesday. my vlog. I don't know, it might be really embarrassing. Hopefully people like it. And she's like, oh, cool Lux. I mean, whatever, that's nice. <laughs> She's just so focused on herself. I don't think she really cares. Maybe let's take a picture together and she can be like, hey, do you want to like go check out Del Sol Valley and see, see what's happening down in town and take some photos there? Like you could take some pictures of me. <laughs> He's like, oh, okay. I mean, I guess we could check it out. So I think we'll get him to go to the toilet quickly. Oh no, that's her. We'll get her to go to the toilet. Oh, they have to take it in turnsies. You know, one time I actually went to the toilet uh, with my friends. Like we sat on it at the same time. This is when I was really, really young. This was ages ago. I mean, it was just like yesterday. <laughs> I'm kidding. Yeah, imagine if you could do that in Sims, like have both of your Sims use it at the same time. If I was going to create a mod, I would totally do that. Oh my gosh, it's 10 o'clock. It's almost too late to go downtown. No, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. All right, so let's check out the new world. Um, so this is Del Sol Valley and we live over here. Uh, this is called Mirage Park where there's reasonably priced homes. Uh, over here is the Pinnacles, which is amazing. It's very much like the Hollywood Hills with all these celebrity homes. And like a lot of people, I feel like we needed a few extra lots. Like I feel like we should have had at least two more lots, one in each of these worlds at the very least. I was a bit surprised about how small it was. Yeah, hopefully in the future they listen to us and we can get more lots um, because I feel like there should be more. And then over here, Starlight Boulevard. So when it comes to the nightlife, Starlight Boulevard cannot be beat. Feels really awkward to read out. Cannot be beat. Cannot beat. <laughs> Where only the most famous Sims have access to the most exclusive, uh, most exclusive nightclub in town. It is where the who's who of the industry come to show off. <gasps> oh my gosh, we have to go down here and check it out. Let's just go to the park. We'll bring Imogen with us and she'll be 
I mean, they've just moved here. They want to check out the town and she'll be like, oh my gosh, I wonder if we'll see any celebrities. She'd be really excited about that. It is nighttime. Oh, it's a little bit chilly. She's got a little beanie and her little, her little outfit on. Oh, they have to get a dog at some stage as well. Oh, there's so many things that I want to do. This is quite a cute park, but let's just have a look around. So you can see here, this kind of looks like Hollywood Boulevard. There's going to be the Sim stars somewhere around here. I don't know, with all, all the lights and the trees look so pretty. Oh, there it is. There's the Walk of Fame. And this actually looks in some ways quite similar to Hollywood. Yeah, I mean, it's a lot nicer than the real life Hollywood, <laughs> uh, in my opinion. But it doesn't look like there's that many people around. It's a little, it's a little dead at this stage, but that's okay. We just wanted to check it out. Ooh. Ooh, it looks like there's a gym we can go to to work out a little bit. There's a nice little rollerblading rink. Very nice. And uh, the big city of Simile, well, Del Sol Valley, off in the distance. Oh my gosh, there's people here. That lady is shining. Oh my gosh, what's happening to her hair? Now this is a look. I like how she has like one strand of hair around her head and the rest is bold. It's a good look. Oh, look, she's even got like that celebrity strut. Okay, I feel like uh, Imogen is not gonna like just stand back. She's gonna be like, oh my gosh, did you see who that was? That's Brittany Cho. She's like a massive deal. So let's maybe introduce a introduction with her. And usually I think this does not turn out very well, but you never know. Imogen might be really nice. And she is a proper, proper celebrity. Oh gosh. She's like, hi. Oh my gosh. I love you. I love your, I don't know what she's a celebrity of, but maybe she's like a actress or something. Ask for a hug. Let's see if she'll hug us. Oh, she's wanting to get that star. Are you serious? Like as if you're going to turn us down. I mean, I guess it is 11 p.m. What happens if we ask to take a picture of her? If we don't touch her, maybe it'll be okay. Are you serious? Why? Can we get an autograph at the very least? Oh my gosh, I do not like Britani. Like Britani, you think you're so awesome? Well, guess what? Your pants don't go with your top, okay? Oh, did she just say yes? Okay, so it looks like persistence pays off. That is awesome. Yay. Okay, I'm so glad that we we actually um, had that work for us. Maybe attempt introduction. Like if someone can get to know celebrities. Oh gosh, I was going to say Imogen can, but she's just embarrassing herself. Oh, so she, oh, oh, guys, we actually got to know her. Look, we actually have a slight relationship. <gasps> We're closer to the stars. Uh -huh. Compliment appearance. We have to be like, oh wow, I really oh, love your headscarf. Oh, it's sure. so nice. Oh, she liked that. Okay, um, exclaim adoration. Adoration? I don't even know what that means. Imply attraction. Is that a little bit keen? Let's just ask about interest. Like we'll play it cool. We'll play it cool. I think we're we're getting a little bit ahead of ourselves, but look, look at this. We're already making friends with a celeb. We are already climbing our way. I'm very excited about this. Maybe um, we'll ask for a hug before we leave and she can be like, oh my gosh, well, it was so nice to meet you, Bryani. And uh, I would love to hang out sometime. I mean, cause it's so easy to meet a celebrity in the street and then become friends, right? <laughs> I don't know, maybe she, she had a few drinks at the nightclub and she didn't really care who we were. Who is this? Dustin. Oh, he's a B-lister. We don't care about him. And where is our little man? Here he is. Oh my gosh, he's so, he's so cute. He's like, I'm just gonna eat in the park and eat my beans while you go and meet celebrities and ditch me, the poor thing. <laughs> oh no. Oh, we didn't get off to a good start with this Vanessa chick who's a notable newcomer. Well, I guess he doesn't care about uh, you know, ew. Okay, that is one sure way not to get famous, I guess. Ooh, is this a celebrity? Oh my gosh, everyone around here is a celebrity. Oh no, that's a notable, notable newcomer. We have the paparazzi over here too. 
He's just waiting for that money shot, isn't he? Fish for compliments? That is such an image and thing for her to do. Well, I think what I'll do here, guys, is um, finish off this part. Um, thank you for joining me, and I hope you like the characters. And good to just, you know, get started into it, ease our way in. And in the next part, we'll hopefully go to our first acting audition and really get into it a little bit more. So thank you so much for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it and as always i hope you're having a lovely morning afternoon or evening wherever you are in the world i will speak to you soon so so oh and don't forget to bring your tea uh to the next part bye